gets the fish He knows the facts He always makes fishing fun For you and everyone Fish Facts TV Fish Facts TV It's time for Fish Facts TV Fish Facts TV, I'm out here at the Dania Beach Pier for the first week of my pier series. Um, so far I haven't seen anybody catch anything big. Uh, a couple look downs. Uh, looks like a lot of people in the surf are fishing for snook. Um, looks like there's quite a few look downs, but I haven't seen anybody catch a big fish yet. I'm gonna be out here a couple hours, so uh, I'll let you guys know what I see. Enjoy. Fish Facts TV, first little mango. Showed up with a whole school of them. I wanted to catch snook, but I'll catch a couple of these for content. And just like everywhere else in South Florida, healthy population of mangrove snappers. Fish. Oh, this is a good fish. This little bar jack maybe? All right. You guys want this? Bar jack. That's a keeper. Gosh, they always shrink on the way up. Gosh, every single one is nine and a half inches. Oh, there we go. Get him out of here. That's a keeper. He's about 11. No, he's at least 12. This 12, yeah. What is that? Is that a snook, baby? Beautiful fish. Sweet. GoPro, stop recording. There we go. A little small, but. There we go. Go. It's a good one. You want him? He's 11. his line oh that's me <laughs> here we go fish facts tv as per usual ten and a half you want it or no There we 
go. Fish Facts TV, Mangrove Master. I find them. So I know how they think. There we go. Not bigger. Oh, damn, there's a huge one. Mangrove Master. There we go. Keeper. Uh, maybe a little short. It's a good looking fish though. Another barely too small one. God dang it. These are some big needlefish. Gross. Fish Facts TV, beautiful day out on the Dania Beach Pier. Um, this is the first episode of my pier series where I'm visiting all the piers in South Florida. Um, you know me, I love to catch a lot of mangrove snappers and that's what I did. Um, caught probably close to two limits. Uh, there were people catching smaller muttons. I didn't see any keeper muttons out on the end. We also saw a lot of snook, but nobody was catching a lot of snook. I was using a 15 pound leader with a yellowtail jig, mostly using live shrimp, but I also got a couple on chunks of ballyhoo. Um, and just for those of you who are wondering what time of year it was when I originally took this, it is September 1st. So it's still a little hot, but things are starting to cool down hopefully soon. And uh, yeah, if you want to catch mangrove snapper, you don't mind um, buying shrimp. It's a good spot. And uh, I used chum. And again, the chum wasn't necessary, but I think it did help later on. Um, also, there's a lot of people catching blue runners. If that's your thing, lots of blue runners here. Enjoy. Enjoy.